The general conviction among most researchers is that the hypothesis of the process by which things came to be is important information for the early times of the universe. This hypothesis joins the progress of stars, planets, and various aspects of the planet's life, such as our inability to endure it. It is a genuinely strange theory known as the Big Bang, an informative assessment of what might have occurred initially. The universe was dense in a small area, more or less ostentatious than a part of a pinhead, thickly dazzled. From this moment, a giant matter and energy had an effect. This event, also known as the Big Bang, set up billions of years ago, fanning out the galactic history. However, actual advancements in information have sparked an increase in abnormalities with the presumptions of this speculation. When NASA launched the James Webb Space Telescope, the largest and most cutting-edge space science observatory of all time, experts theorized that its findings would support the speculation of the universe's origin. Unfortunately, after just a year in space, the telescope flabbergasted experts with its ability to peer so deeply into the universe. Before James Webb, the alarming limits of the telescope revealed numerous systems that reached as far back to a time so old that it challenges our understanding of the universe's origins. This discovery has ignited a thorough examination of the situation before the Big Bang. One key moment in this mission occurred when cosmologist Rowan Natu, working with data from the telescope, unexpectedly found a galaxy from just a brief time after the Big Bang, making it the most distant galaxy ever witnessed. Natu's discovery sent shockwaves through established researchers showcasing the remarkable capabilities of the James Webb Space Telescope. Its primary objective to alter our perspective on the universe has only just begun, promising to uncover astonishing insights into the earliest stages in the evolution of the universe. This period, which has not been much studied before, holds the key to understanding the progress of the first stars and structures. The discoveries made by the telescope have defied the initial theory, demonstrating characteristics-based systems outperforming past expectations. This significant influx of early systems has sparked a storm of scientific inquiry, testing experts to take into account these findings with existing theories. As researchers wrestle with these discoveries, they face fundamental questions about the very nature of the universe and the forces that shaped its development. Beyond the James Webb advancements, the telescope, which is 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth, safe from normal interference and cooled to near absolute zero by its tennis court-sized sunshield, features a huge segmented mirror and incredibly sensitive instruments that reveal specifics of the early universe previously hidden. This period, known as the Big Dawn, occurred around a couple of hundred million years after the Big Bang, marking when the first stars and galaxies began to form. The process by which this unfolded remains a subject of intense research, with hypotheses ranging from the effects of dark matter and dark energy to the interactions between star-forming gas and dust. As seen by telescopes of galaxies from the Dawn Galaxy Cluster, this presents a one-of-a-kind chance for cosmologists to test how they could interpret these complex dynamics. By examining these ancient methods, researchers have to options, either confirm the reliability of their existing models or reveal gaps in understanding that could lead to pivotal new discoveries. Initially, the telescope was expected to observe only a few faint and small galaxies in its pilot studies. However, reality has far outperformed these expectations. The telescope's early images of the distant universe revealed an abundance of galaxies with ages, sizes, and levels of brightness that defied all predictions. This astounding overflow of early galaxies has sparked a race among experts in space to set new records for the earliest known galaxies, with new discoveries emerging every day, leaving the scientific community in awe. Following the James Webb Telescope's discoveries, specialists and observers have hurriedly investigated the presence of these surprisingly advanced early galaxies. Some speculate that errors in the telescope's interpretation of huge observations could be responsible for these unexpected findings. 
That said, there is still agreement that these discoveries represent a paradigm shift in how we might interpret the early universe and give fascinating glimpses into the potential for new cosmic evolution discoveries. Discoveries by the James Webb Space Telescope regarding galaxies have raised fundamental questions about the nature of the universe and attempted to test the assumptions of standard cosmological models. While certain scientists are checking to see if these observations can be reconciled with existing theories, others suggest that they may be the first signs that the universe is far more confusing and complicated than previously imagined. The question at stake is our fundamental understanding of how the universe we know arose out of primordial chaos. The early revelations of the JWST could reshape our essential ideas of cosmic history, uncovering insights not only on distant galaxies and ancient structures, but also on the very nature of our universe. As Mark, senior scientist for science and research at the European Space Organization, helps you construct these machines that do not support theory but rather break it, you simply have no idea how it will endanger the history of the JWST. The history of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST can be traced back to the Space Telescope Science Institute STSCI in 1985, even before the Hubble Space Telescope was launched. At the time, the responsibility of carrying out and imagining the potential successors to Hubble fell to a group that began preparing the way for what would become the James Webb Space Telescope. Unlike Hubble, which captures primarily visible light, the purpose of JWST was to observe in the infrared spectrum, allowing it to peer much deeper into the universe. This ability is essential for studying galaxies far away, whose light has been stretched into the infrared due to the expansion of the universe, making them invisible to telescopes such as Hubble. Its enormous, cold, star-like mirror made the JWST the premier tool for unlocking the secrets of Cosmic Dawn. The need for the JWST was highlighted in 1995 when the Hubble Deep Field observation revealed a significant number of galaxies in what was believed to be an empty patch of sky. This revelation demonstrated the richness of the early universe and emphasized the necessity of a telescope that could go much deeper into cosmic history. After 20 long years of development and a cost of around $1 billion, the JWST was finally launched on December 25, 2021. By July 2022, it was ready to begin its most critical year of early scientific observations. Initiatives like the Early Release Science Program and the General Observer Program were specifically designed to look for early galaxies. While expectations were modest, the results far surpassed them. JWST observations have challenged the early models of the universe, revealing galaxies that defy assumptions of conventional cosmology. These remarkable discoveries emphasize the importance of pushing the boundaries of scientific inquiry and highlight the exceptional, cutting-edge capabilities of techniques such as the James Webb Space Telescope. As researchers keep looking at whatever data they can uncover, further insights test and expand our understanding of the universe. When the first data began rolling in from the JWST, cosmologists were eagerly anticipating the outcomes, having prepared their data analysis pipelines for this moment for years. Instead of following the traditional peer review procedure, which typically takes several months, researchers made the decision to share discoveries on preprint servers like Arxiv, a platform for research papers that have not yet been reviewed by experts. This approach allowed for a new type of peer review to take place via platforms like Twitter where the community of scientists could quickly discuss findings. Rowan Nata described this process as science by press release, and the ensuing storm of discussion was heated and remarkable. However, there were questions about this approach's potential drawbacks. Rapid dissemination of results as Claus Pontypool, a JWST project scientist at STSCI, warned could risk overwhelming the process. The general agreement among most researchers is that speculation about how things came to be remains the essential explanation for the early times of the universe. 
This hypothesis incorporates the movement of stars, planets, and their inhabitants, including ourselves. Despite its unusual name, the Big Bang offers a significant justification for what occurred at the beginning of the universe. The universe was tightly packed into a space smaller than a pinhead filled with tightly packed particles. At that moment, a massive effect of matter and energy, the Big Bang or the explosion of energy, occurred. This event, happening billions of years ago, set the stage for the unfolding of past changes in galactic history. However, scientific information has led to growing disparities with the assumptions underlying this theory. When NASA launched the James Webb Space Telescope, the largest and most advanced space science observatory ever built, researchers hypothesized that observations would support the theory of the universe's origin. Unfortunately, after just one year in space, the telescope shocked scientists with its ability to thoroughly examine the universe. Before the James Webb Space Telescope's remarkable abilities, revealed galaxies from the early universe posed a challenge to the understanding of the universe's origins. This finding has sparked serious investigation into what was previously called the Big Bang. 